Hi, my name's Chris Hughes. Um, I just want to do a quick tutorial on the modeling toolkit new in Maya 2014. I was having a play with it uh, this morning and had some issues with symmetry and I just wanted to show people um, how I worked out well, the solution I worked out and what was happening. So first of all let's just draw out um, some geometry um, add some um, subdivisions, say four Okay, and now I want to do some box modeling um, using the new toolkit. So the toolkit's accessed from the top right hand corner. Click on that. Um, to activate it, you can click this or you can go down to any of these auto activate or activate modeling toolkit. So if we click on that, um, what we get is it converts it to um, component mode. Um, now if I select an edge, um, then what you need, sometimes I've noticed that symmetry is automatically activated so to get symmetry you need to select an edge um, and then you click on the symmetry button and you're in business or at least you think you are so I can select um, a whole lot of faces um, maybe some extra ones here and I want to move those around so I select the move tool and I'm getting this really weird behavior where it is almost like it's rotating around the, the symmetry point. It's just not doing what it needs uh, to do. Um, if I just undo those, you can try things like extrude as well. Sometimes that seems to work, sometimes it doesn't. In this case it seems to be working okay. Um, however, there's been other instances where I've had um, issues. Now, what is the problem here? what I found was that it's the fact that this line here where I've selected the edge for symmetry has no angles it's just a straight line with a zero zero angle what the modeling cool toolkit needs is some sort of edge or angle to make it work properly so if I select this edge again um, and I unclick symmetry and then I just move it out ever so slightly so there's now an angle here and an angle here when um, you click on the symmetry button now what happens is is that loop that angle the halfway between those angles is the where the plane is which will be in this case all the way down the center line so now if I select a point and I move it it moves symmetrically and things seem to work very well and I can do faces and extrude whatever I want um, so it's all about the have selecting an edge that has a little bit of an angle so that the algorithm can work out the symmetrical plane for example if we delete this um, piece of geometry and draw out a sphere because this has got um, angles even though they're quite slight between each of these edges if I go into um, and select an edge and then um, turn on symmetry it's very easy because of that slight angle for the program to work out what the plane is and the plane is running along this line of edges so this t in this case um, I can extrude I can select some polygon polygons and then move them and they'll move symmetrically alright so all you have to remember is if you're selecting an edge for symmetry make sure it's not part of a flat plane and that there is some sort of angle um, along that edge so that the uh, modeling toolkit sym symmetry algorithm can work out uh, which angle it needs to be hope this helps Thanks.